Hey folks, Doc C here. I just wanted to be able to talk with you a little bit more, a uh, short little conversation about beds. You know, my last conversation um, on Santa Says, um, I'm wearing the chiropractic cap, but I almost need to wear two because I need to wear uh, the Santa hat as well. Because, you know, talking about bigger folks, um, you want a better bed. And I talked a little bit about that, about the, the general ideas of a bed. But what I want to do now is actually, I do want to be able to, now I'm, I have no affiliation with any of this. None of them, no one's paying me to talk about beds. But what I found is, is that for bigger folks, if you weigh over a certain amount, you know, let's say two, 300 people, let's say 20, uh, 280, 300 pounds. If you weigh more than that, you need a better bed. Um, it's as simple as that. Uh, they, they wear out too fast. They just don't give you the support. So I looked up some of the better beds that are out there. Now, I looked on the website um, Mattress Clarity and uh, they were, it was very helpful. Now, I would, ad I would advise you to go on there and look yourself, but here's some different ones. Um, the best mattress is for heavy people, um, said their top picks. Now, you gotta remember on their site, they have, um, they have other people's reviews. So you may get a little tweak. You may have to go on there and tweak your ideas because you really want to be able to be specific with this because uh, beds do big, bigger, better beds do cost a bit more. So, but you know, there's, there's two things you don't skimp on. One's your bed and one's your, your shoes. When you're not on one, you're on the other. So you got to make sure that you make a good investment in a bed. Now, um, the best overall bed they said for bigger folks was called the Titan Plus Lux. Um, it had a 4.3 out of five. The um, next, well, the, now um, best memory foam mattress for heavy sleepers was called the Nectar Premium. It was a 4.4 out of five. Um, the um, best firm mattress for heavy sleepers was the Helix Plus, a 4.3 out of five. Um, the best mattress for heavy couples um, is uh, Emma Climax Hybrid. 4.5 out of 5. Um, the best mattress for heavy people with back pain. As a chiropractor, you know, always dealing with that. Um, it's called the Winx Bed Plus. I I haven't tried it. I don't know as much about it. I'm I'm just telling you the ones that they have looked at. Um, the cooling, the best cooling mattress for heavy people. So if you're living in an area where you don't have a lot of air conditioning, but every once in a while you get a hot night, like here in in Canada. Um, we'll get periods of time where it gets hot and it's nice to have a bed that kind of helps with that uh, Best cooling mattress for heavy sleepers was the Nolan Evolution Hybrid um, There was the best hybrid mattress for heavy sleepers uh, Is Bear Elite Hybrid It was a 4.5 out of 5 um, Best mattress for heavy sleepers uh, Sorry, best mattress for heavy uh, stomach sleepers which I don't like personally, because when you sleep on your stomach, you have to turn your head and sometimes you'll wake up with a case of wry neck, but some people are that way. And you just, it, I have a daughter, I have a hard time getting her off her stomach. Even now she's married and she's got kids. And I think she still goes to her stomach uh, many, many times. Um, it was called the Plank Firm. Um, it's a 4.2 out of five. Now, like I say, make sure you go back and you take a look now. Um, the best for heavy side sleepers was a 4.6 out of 5. Uh, that was called the Sativa HD. I've heard a lot of things about that bed. Um, that bed's been around for a while. They made it specifically for, for heavy people. They didn't take a, a bed that's made for the average person and add a few coils. They made that specifically for bigger folks. It's for side sleepers. Um, that's what it's meant for. Um, now, best mattress for heavy back sleepers is the Puffy Lux Hybrid. Now, it's a 4.0 out of, out of 5. So, again, take a, go on that site, if you would, Mattress Clarity, because they should have a lot more information on there. Uh, again, um, you know, your ability to sleep is so linked to your body's ability to deal with stress. It's extremely important. So, I would advise you to be able to take a look on that Um and just make a plan. You really want to be able to plan this out and get a good night's sleep and to be able to enjoy it because with all the stresses of today, chemical, physical, emotional stress, you got to deal with them. And one of the ways is with rest. Anyway, 
Always remember, Santa says, have a great one. Take care.